the reign of the Lord's anointed. Why are the nations restless and the peoples plotting in vain? The kings of the earth take their stand and the rulers conspire together against the Lord and against his anointed, saying, Let's tear their shackles apart and throw their ropes away from us. He who sits in the heavens laughs, the Lord scoffs at them. Then he will speak to them in his anger and terrify them in his fury, saying, But as for me, I have installed my king upon Zion, my holy mountain. I will announce the decree of the Lord, he said to me, You are my son, today I have fathered you. Ask it of me, and I will certainly give the nations as your inheritance, and the ends of the earth as your possession. You shall break them with a rod of iron, you shall shatter them like earthenware. Now then, you kings, use insight. Let yourselves be instructed, you judges of the earth. Serve the Lord with reverence and rejoice with trembling. Kiss the son, that he not be angry, and you perish on the way, for his wrath may be kindled quickly. How blessed are all who take refuge in him.